Chicago, I'd like to ask you, uh, what's it like down there? It's fantastic. Imagine having no weight. Imagine that this would be underwater. You would move like this, swimming in space above all your little friends. It's beautiful. When my friends and I started, it was for us the pleasure of discovering. I wanted to show what was in the sea so that people would love it. In order to go deeper, in order to stay longer, I became an inventor by necessity. People at that time had no idea of what was going on under the surface. I had to put a camera in a housing, so I had to invent that too. That's when I understood the power of images. My films are no more just about beautiful little fish. I try to convince people that they have to do something about this. We are dealing with the fate of mankind. We began to see that the things that we had admired were beginning to decay. And we said, we have to do something. We have to enter the fight. Because you only really protect what you love. Is he a scientist, researcher, philosopher? He really looked like a man looking at the future. His motto was, we go see it for ourselves. Can you tell me what you think are your greatest accomplishments and your greatest failures? I am not interested in myself. I'm interested in the world outside me.